Today I'm gonna to do a short tutorial on how to close an event in your back office. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do as always is log into your back office. Normally, if you had an event that you hadn't started closing yet, you would just click your events and find it here, click edit, and then in the lower left-hand corner, there would be a button to create the order. Um, however, in this instance, I've already started this, so I wanna revisit the um, event that I'm closing out. You're just gonna find that under order and you'll find it down here. Um, it will say party order and the person's name and you're just gonna click continue. Okay, so um, if this person was able to book another party for someone else, you would wanna click the create booking. Um, and then if someone else had, um, if this was a result from someone else hosting a party, then you'd wanna put in the booking um, ID here so that that person gets the $15 credits. In this case, I'm just gonna give myself the credit because um, I booked it or I closed my party and I created a booking ID for myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and look up my own booking ID so I can get that $15 credit and then that way it doesn't ever go to waste. Okay, and then we're gonna keep all this. This is all her information here. We're gonna save and continue. And the first thing we're gonna do is put in her half price items. And I've already talked with my hostess about this, about what she wants. Um, and obviously you wanna apply the 50% off to the most expensive items. So she's gonna be getting um, the Royal Shine for half off. And then also the Tangerine Bomber Jacket at half off uh, to order. And then she also has her Hostess Credits. And she's gonna get the white Bomber Bra. And keep in mind when you add this one, this one's currently on back order. So just make sure to let your hostess know or any guests. So you're gonna get this, um, that as soon as this item um, comes back in stock, it will ship out, but it won't be included in the order um, with the party order, just so they know that. So you're gonna click continue and all of your information will show up right here. So here's my hostess. She's got her half price in there, her tangerine bomber jacket and her white bomber bra. She's using her hostess credits. One thing to remember, um, you PV does not get applied for um, for things half off. It does if it goes over the credit. So she's got her twenty five dollar credit. Um, so anything beyond that will go towards your PV or any retail she adds um, will go to your PV. But unfortunately, half off items do not go towards your own PV. So just keep that in mind. But the other part I want to show you. So remember, I just applied my own booking ID. Um, and so now in the drop down, you're going to find um, my name now is going to show up and it's going to say previous hosting hostess booking dollars. So you're going to click that and then I'm going to get the training gloves because I wanted those and I figure I can use those when it's cold in the dog out. So I'm going to add those and let's go ahead and do a small. I'm going to add that to the order and now it's going to show so here's my name and it's gonna show that my training gloves are now only $10 plus my shipping and tax. So the total is $15, but it gave me that $15 credit, which is pretty cool. Um, and then the other thing, all the other party orders will be on there. And then um, you can always check down here to make sure that everything's been applied. Um, so make sure you've claimed all your half price um, items and any credits and then your overage, this is what will be applied to the PB for her orders um, because that's what she went over in um, her credit. So hopefully that helps. It's really simple. Um, you'll Once you do it a few times, you'll get the hang of it and you'll be able to close it so quickly. Um, and then really once you're at this point, I'm not gonna close it out because I need to get her information, um, but it will say, it will ask you, make sure you've used everything, you hit okay, and then you're ready to submit the order. Hope that helps guys. Um, let me know if you have any other questions on this, but it's pretty straightforward. Um, the trickiest part is that booking ID. So it took me a couple times, it wasn't working. If it doesn't work ever, message Megan, message customer service, and they'll go ahead and just um, apply a $15 credit towards um, the previous hostess, um, whatever she wants to buy, and they'll just refund her the 15. So don't worry, don't panic if it doesn't work, um, they'll still get the $15 credit. Um, but hopefully that helps you kind of walk through in your back office how to close everything.